Hello everyone, welcome back to Draw and Dance and today it's time to draw and dance the train. We're going to start by thinking about straight and curved lines. That's our focus for today. Borrow the robot has moved in with all of the people and the crongly dong and today everybody's noticed that Borrow's making a lot of noise in his workshop. So they've listened to what he's doing and noticed that all the banging and the hammering has created a train. The train is made up of straight lines, just like we used in the robot. And then also today, we're introducing some of those arcades and garlands that we looked at when we created the volcano to begin with. Watch some of those actions. <laughs> Well done. Now we're going to create some of those arcades and garlands from the smoke from the train on the table using a lot of shaving foam and a little bit of paint. Watch now as we squirt the shaving foam and a drop of paint. Spread it all out on the table. and then enjoy those arcade and garland patterns. arcades and garlands and now if you place a piece of paper over the top and press gently smoothing the paper down over the top of the shaving foam and paint you'll see that as you lift it you've preserved those beautiful patterns on paper. Now we're going to use those garlands and arcades to create a chalk picture the garlands are the opening out actions that you can see here, free and open. The arcades are the actions that look like you've got the arches of an arcade, but move down. Watch as they're drawn on the chalkboard now. <laughs> Chalking, now we're taking those gar garlands and arcades and making them smaller on the paper following the lines. This will help the children as they develop their handwriting onto lined paper. If you look here, you can see that the garlands on the top line are opening out and the arcades on the second line create that shape of an arcade. We're going to start with the garlands now.
done lovely flowing actions and now we're moving on to the arcades. Remember to check that tripod grip to make sure that your finger and thumb are resting comfortably on the pen and then your other fingers are sitting beneath. Off we go. use those garlands and arcades to create smoke and wheels for a train. Look at the train because we've used the shapes that we learned from those angular straight lines from the robot to create the carriages of the train. And underneath we're now going to watch the arcades create the wheels and the garlands create the smoke. Off we go. <laughs> using both hands and using our dominant hand. Make sure that you still practice that tripod grip and as you work, concentrate on making the actions that you make smaller and smaller. You can even use lots of the actions and dancing actions that we've created over the last few days together to create a big picture. If you look at this one, we've used the volcano to make volcano and mountains. We've used the circles and eights to create the trees. We've even got Borrow the Robot from the straight angular lines and a couple of Cronley Dons appear near the tree. And we've finished off with the train at the end with the garlands and arcades. Have great fun everyone with your train and other actions that we've learned over the last few days. See you again next time. Bye bye for now. <laughs>